Wake up, girl. Last time you'll be in this belly. It's finally come. We're now at the hospital, and I get to meet my daughter in a few hours. Like we've been preparing for this for a while, and now it's finally here. And just praying that uh, the Terra's safe and that and that the baby's safe. We had gone over that she wanted the spinal instead of the ep epidural. Yeah, yeah, don't worry about that. Just little people in our spines, and we've heard some horror stories. And The difference between the one-touch spinal and the epidural is with the one-touch spinal, you're looking at inserting a needle and the medicine. When it comes to an epidural, you're looking at inserting the needle, keeping that catheter inside the back until it's reached its level of numbness. Okay, so we will talk to you about it. Don't worry. Maybe I'm worrying over nothing, but I've always heard epidurals were not good for little people. So I want to stick with my birth plan and make sure that I'm making every right decision for myself as well as my baby. I am feeling strongly that I want to stick with getting a spinal. I'm sorry, I'm not trying to get emotional. I mean, it sounds like there's pros and cons of both, but uh, it just goes like against everything that I thought we already had planned out with these doctors. I just want to see you. Of course. Their, your safety is number one on their mind. No, so maybe I'm just getting emotional over nothing. Well, it's not over nothing. It's... <clears throat> I mean, I want her to be safe, totally. She's gonna be safe. I wanna be safe, oh, too. Yeah, we want, we want you to be safe. You're gonna be okay either way. 